Kerith's work offers us a liberating space where the poetic and the mechanical meet, both in terms of our position in the world and in relation to, to the sculpture in the space. Kerith is perhaps best known for his works using neon, like the work installed earlier this year at National Museum's Cardiff. These neon works and the flute piece we have here at the Hepworth resonate with each other in terms of their form. We can see that he includes sculptural elements radiating out from a number of central points. These forms of energy, light and sound, are really just as important to Kerith sculptures as the more tangible materials of glass tubing and metal armatures. Kerith's always very attuned to how his work is staged within and framed by the architecture he's, he's installing in. He was very much drawn to the idea that the energy that's harnessed from the River Calder and the weir that, that lies just outside the gallery are controlled by a vast system of pipes and pumps in the basement of the gallery and this idea that the energy is transformed into something that we feel inside the gallery spaces. So this translation of, of energy into experience.